Morning friends, hope you guys are well today. I'm doing wonderful. It's a Monday morning, 7 a.m. I've been up for about an hour and a half. I've got a lot of stuff to do today. So hang out with me while we do some chamfers. Mm. Good coffee. Do some chamfers on these chairs. That way maybe we can stain them tonight. Oh, and I forgot to mention, I've got a new, new, <laughs> a new tool. Guys, I ordered me a mic, headphones, so I will eventually be able to listen to my music again while I'm doing this. I really miss that. So here's the new new tool. Tool. I cannot talk this morning. I haven't had enough coffee yet. Are you guys like that? Can't talk until you got enough coffee. I sure am. Lee Nielsen, 60 and a half, rabbiting block plane with the built-in knickers. This, I already tried this out and I absolutely love it. And I'm not sure yet. I may link that other video I made of opening this package up right now. And they package this with newspapers. I have not seen that when they hook up and maybe I just don't order enough tools from good companies. Are you guys excited as I am? I must say, of course, this may lead to cancer. Alright, number 60 and a half, rabbit block plane. Oh my gosh. I'm like a kid right now. I've got to get my good scrap. It's perfect. That's what a good plane feels like. Wow. There it is. Lee Nelson. Rabbiting block plane. So, I thought I would save some money. Instead of getting a good block plane and a shoulder plane, I get this and I do both. What y'all think? Now that we're back, it feels the same on both sides. So let's try this. See, I haven't even sharpened this thing. Beyond expectations. Without sharpening. That's nice and clean. Now all I gotta do is just sand it off just a little bit. I 
I will say this. As you see right there, you have to be really careful because it cuts all the way to the edge. So I think for chamfering uh, exposed tenons, this is maybe not the right tool, but I was trying to save myself some money in the long run by getting this instead of the Wood River block plane that I mentioned. I don't have a lot of practice with this thing either. going to have to keep it away from the the legs zoom in that's going to be beautiful I was talking about River block plane, low angle, what I wanted. If I got that, and then to do the 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 shoulders of tenons and such, I would need a shoulder plane. But this, I can do both, and that's why I got this one instead. I'm impressed. Not even sharpened. Out of the box. can't get over it. It's Sorry if I'm blocking you the view with my head. I'll reposition this camera in a second.
Maybe it's not. That one's done, I think. Yeah, I'm not sure if I got this on camera, but I already did these. A handy dandy rag here. <laughs> Sandra, don't kill me. I'm not going to film the other one, guys. I've got a lot of things to do today, so this will wrap up the video. Um, hopefully, you enjoyed this. I've got maybe two more videos to go, maybe three. I might do a final video once I get some editing software and link all these videos together, put it together. Because I know that there's over 50 videos for this chair build. I've learned a lot during this uh, build. It's taken me, <laughs> let's see, I started last September actually. And it's May right now. But I had an injury when I was uh, getting everything uh, ready for milling. And that put, that, that uh, postponed a lot. But, uh. And I would have already been done, but it takes a lot of time to to do the, the videos, even when you don't do many, much editing as myself. But anyway, until next time, y'all take care. God bless. Have a good one.